Good morning. Today is, boy, it's sunny out there too. Let's see. <clears throat> is that any better? <clears throat> Sorry, my sinuses are draining. That'll give you a clue that it's raining. Uh, it's Wednesday, March 1st. Uh, it's Ash Wednesday. Uh, I didn't get my ashes yet, obviously. You can see that. But um, it's 53 degrees. It's really nice. If it wasn't for the rain, I'd be walking. But um, it's also the anniversary of my mother's passing. Uh, she passed um, nine years ago today. It doesn't seem possible. It really doesn't. Um, I do remember that it was a leap year, and I was so afraid she was going to die on the 29th. What difference would it have made, I know. But it's just, uh, I don't know. It's a day I like to remember her by. So it's just, uh, not that I don't think of her all the time, but I do. So I'm going to eat very, very light today um, as a penance. Um, I'm going to have probably my usual breakfast, but I probably won't have, well, obviously I won't have bacon because I can't have meat. And, uh, and then just that, and then uh, like I think I'm going to have a salad and cottage cheese for dinner, but I'm not going to load it up with uh, meat and everything that I usually put on it. So, um, well, that's about it. I know, boring. I <clears throat> went to do laundry because I have a lot of laundry. As much as I've done laundry in the past few weeks, I kind of slacked off. And I went to do it, and I have no laundry soap. I went and got to groceries yesterday, and I forgot to buy laundry soap. So I'm um, going to go back to get the laundry soap. And um, what else? I noticed on Weight Watchers with Carrie that um, somehow YouTube unsubscribed me from her. So I went and resubscribed. So if, if you see that I'm not subscribed to you and I was in the past or I haven't been making comments and I have been making comments in the past, you know, let me know. Um, I pretty much go by the notifications that I get and because uh, I watch a lot of you. I really do. And especially the ones that support my channel. And um, I like to watch your videos and support you back. So if, if, uh, if you, fi you find that I have, you haven't heard from me, let me know. I want to know. I really do. And as always, I, I welcome your comments. Um, I accept criticism. I, I'm not thin-skinned. I really am not. Um, look at me. I'm not thin-skinned. So, um, you know, I don't want you to say, oh, you're a big fat slob. You know, no, I don't. But, you know, like if you give me a constructive criticism, I can always take that. Um, being a Virgo, I'm very critical by nature anyhow. So um, it's one of my faults. One of my few faults. No, I have a lot of faults. I'm human. Everybody has faults. So um, let's go to Kroger's. And guess what? I've just realized reaching into my pocket, I forgot my car keys. And my car has to have a key to start. So it's not like the Flintstones when you could run like a Flintstones. Meet the Flintstones. They're a modern Stone Age family in their town of bedrock. They're a play page right out of history. Does anybody watch that? I used to watch it all the time as a child. So, okay, let's go. Enough of my singing. You've had enough. I've ruined your day. Okay, just leaving Kroger's. I spent $20 just on cleaning supplies because I'm out here. I might as well get some stuff. I um, got to clean my cupboards. So I got some uh, Murphy soap and then I needed uh, um, what else today? Oh, some granite top cleaners. So I got that. Toothpaste was on sale, so I got some toothpaste, and then I got Jim's fix it in. Because Jim's got false teeth, but don't tell anybody. So, um, gonna head home now. Drink some water. Begin my day of not eating that much. See you guys in a bit. Okay, the picture of those punch keys or the video didn't really do them justice because um, they look kind of small in that box. So I thought I'd give you 10 facts about punch keys. Uh, the name punch key is Polish and it means little package. And number two is punch key is plural, which means you ate more than one. If you were only going to eat one, you ate a punchek. But most people eat punch keys because they're, you know, I don't like them, but they're very, they're very, very popular among the uh, Polish community. Um, Hamtramck is our um, 
a lot of Polish people have settled in there, and um, they call it Pole Town, you know, like Chinatown, Pole Town. But um, they have a lot of really good Polish restaurants and, um, you know, bakeries and things like that. Um, number three, uh, the punchki was used way back when um, it was, you used up all the fatty ingredients in your cupboards like lard and butter as well as sugar, eggs, and fruit before uh, Lent began and you began your fasting. Um, it was a tradition you didn't want to have all that stuff in the house because um, it would tempt you and you were supposed to fast for the 40 days and 40 nights of Lent. Um, number four, don't call them a donut. They are not a donut. I love donuts, and so I can attest to that fact. They are not a donut. Um, they are so much richer in flavor. They're heavier, and um, the dough is uh, kind of yeasty because it's made with so many eggs. That might be. I mean, I like eggs, but um, I don't know. I am not a punchki fan. Sorry, but um, in Poland, um, the last Thursday before Lent begins, they call Fat Thursday. Um, in the United States. We do with Fat Tuesday, which is the day before Lent begins, and they have the Mardi Gras down in New Orleans and stuff like that. Um, a small amount of grain, grain alcohol is used in the filling. Go figure. <laughs> Got to get rid of that booze somehow. So like, why not put it in a donut? Oh, it's not a donut. Put it in a punchki. Um, and a punchki, and this is going to be a fact that people around the world are going to be shocked to learn that the punchki in Poland is much smaller than the supersize American size. Uh, we do everything too big. We do everything supersized. So it doesn't surprise me that it's way smaller in Poland than it is here. Um, the average price, this is another reason I don't really like punchkis. The prices range from $12.50 to $16 a dozen. They're pretty good size. They're about, I'd say they're about that big. That's a pretty good size. and. Uh, they're filled with um, anything from jelly to custard to chocolate, and uh, they're drizzled with powdered sugar. Some are drizzled with uh, icing or glaze. Some are drizzled with chocolate. Um, they're just they're just really really fattening. And to give you an idea, depending on the size, um, they come in all sizes, obviously. But the normal size, which is not normal, but a, a regular size punchki, is 400 calories and more than 20 grams of fat. So that's why, you, that's one good reason I don't like them because I couldn't handle all that. So um, there's my facts about uh, punchkis. Uh, I forget, I'm gonna look up and see who it was that wanted to know. I'll be right back. Okay, I looked her up. It was Deborah Carr and, not the actress Deborah Carr, C-A-R-R, -R, not K-E-R-R. -R. And um, she's from New Jersey, and she said that uh, she never heard of them. I thought that they were all around the United States, but I could be wrong, obviously. I've been wrong in the past. Look at my hair. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, enough about me. Let's get on with my day. I got laundry, 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 and some more laundry to do. Okay, I'm gonna start eating my breakfast. Um, I told you I was going to eat light, but now that I'm looking at it, it doesn't look that light. Um, I have tea and water, my grapefruit, uh, tomato, cheese, egg, strawberries, and bananas. Um, I started my day with a prayer. So far I've drank 48 ounces of water. I've walked 4,000 steps. I've used this quote before, but I was going to use it again today in remembrance of Ash Wednesday. God gave us the gift of life. It's our job to give ourselves the gift of living well. I have 37 smart points, two points for my egg, zero for the strawberries, the grapefruit, the tomato, and the banana, and the tea in the water, and four ounces, four points for my cheese. So six smart points. Um, I'm telling you, I was a rat in another life. Okay, time to eat dinner. Um, I told you I was going to have a big salad with some cottage cheese. I threw a couple strawberries in there too. Um, iced tea and water. I had 29 points to use. My salad is zero, uh, which is Italian blend lettuce with cucumbers and tomatoes. And uh, one ounce of feta cheese is three points. Um, one ounce of provolone is four points. Two tablespoons of my dressing is six points. A half a cup of cottage cheese is three points. And my tea and my water are free. So it's 16 points. So I still have 13 points. But like I said, I'm trying to fast today for Ash Wednesday, so 
Um, I did use four of my weekly so far, so I don't know. We'll see how that goes. Okay, can someone explain to me why? I didn't really eat that much today, but I'm not that hungry. But any other day, I would have thought I was depriving myself. I don't know. I can't understand it. I really don't. Um, that's about it for tonight. It's getting cold. It was so nice today. I went to Kroger's without a jacket on. And then um, I think it got up to 62. And right now it's almost 8 o'clock. And um, it's 32. And it's supposed to get colder. And the wind is whipping. They have wind gusts up to 45 miles an hour. I've got My windows got hit a couple times by flying debris. <laughs> so... Um, all those tornadoes that hit, I was just very thankful that we just got a little bit of rain. Well, not a little bit of rain. We got a lot of rain and a little bit of thunder and lightning, but it uh, could have been so much worse. So my hearts and my prayers go out to everybody that got hit by the bad weather. Um, that's about it for tonight. Like this video. Subscribe. Comment. You know, I love your comments. And share if you think it'll help somebody.